the composition of the board uh, that the majority leader was speaking to, uh, as I have done in other uh, bills that have come before this House that were essentially uh, regulating matters that I believe are devolved functions. Number two, Mr. Speaker, I've had very uh, interesting conversations with young people in this country. One of the things, I'm a grown-up spending my own money. What business do you have as a legislator in my life? Mr. Speaker, this is one of those other legislations. And I want to speak as a person who has won money on numerous occasions on account of Arsenal losing. Mr. Speaker, I have also, I want to confirm that I have placed a bet on this tonight's game against uh, Bayern Munich because I know Arsenal are going to lose. And uh, so as uh, a friend of uh, members of this house, I encourage you to make a little money today because Arsenal is going to lose again. Mr. Speaker. Senator Sifuna, there is a point of order from Senator Karen Yam. Close in. Mr. Speaker, I have in this house presented my issue with Aluta. It is about our young people. Is the Senator for Nairobi in order to imply that I'm trying to regulate grown-ups from partying whenever they want to? And also... Uh, in the house, Mr. Speaker, because the comeback that we are about to put up, he will, he will silence him forever. Yes, Senator Sifuna, you cannot uh, bring issues uh, to do with us no, without bringing a substant substantive motion. Substantive motion. Proceed. Mr. Speaker, you want me to bring a substantive motion to discuss us no? Uh, but the, the point that I was making, uh, Mr. Speaker, and this is something that uh, uh, the majority leader alluded to, is that some of these things are personal choices. Although this facility is available for everyone, not everybody engages in gambling. But what we should not do, uh, Mr. Speaker, uh, I have seen this uh, very worrying trend, where we want to demonize and criminalize everything, uh, so that uh, uh, Shere is being painted as something that is very evil and somehow that it is targeting young people. Mr. Speaker, we have laws on our books to prevent operators of a club, just like this law that we are debating this afternoon. It has restrictions on the age limits of the people who can participate. There is a restriction on the age of persons who can enter into a club in Nairobi or anywhere else, Mr. Speaker. So that having the rules there should be sufficient for us not to criminalize the activities. We are trying to make sure that the activity is conducted in a manner that is safe, in a manner that does not endanger the lives of people, or in, in fact jeopardize uh, the future of young people. Mr. Speaker, I went through the fourth schedule to ascertain that in fact this is a function that can properly be undertaken by the national government. Mr. Speaker, if you look at the submissions by the majority leader, I think that is one of the speeches by the majority leader that has earned him applause from our side, because he has been saying, about legislation that comes before this house. Not least